doing max cardio intervals, I think it's what it's called. Um, first day of month two of Max Insanity. Um, I have cooled off a little bit, but, because I walked around to the, went to the bedroom and whatever. I like cool off faster than it, whatever. So, like, I know I'm not all that sweaty. I am, but I'm not. Like, you can't see it, but, I mean, I am soaked. <laughs> It's like gross soakness, but whatever. So, um, the first day of Max Insanity 2 is not, and I do apologize for the shakiness of this, but my hand, my muscles in my arms are so, um, they're weak. <laughs> uh, so anyway, um, first day of month two, there's new moves in it, and some of them are a little bit hard, um, I'm gonna have to stay, I'm gonna have to like pay attention to my form on one of the moves a little bit better because my back was a little bit like ugh after so I was clearly not doing it quite correctly and so I have to be careful about that obviously. Don't want to injure myself. <laughs> um, yeah, so I hope you guys have an awesome morning. Don't forget to push play. That is the hardest thing. Um, also, you know, just do five minutes if you don't want to really work out, because five minutes can lead to ten or more. <laughs> Alright guys, have a great morning and a day, and I will see you a little bit later. Do a quick um, update of my measurements, and I apologize, I haven't put the makeup on yet. Um, pretty much this whole video is going to be without makeup. <laughs> I don't mind. Y'all might mind, but I don't mind. <laughs> okay. Week. My last week of the first month of insanity. Um, I'll just say the whole entire month I was going up and down. Three pounds. I managed to lose four. Um, and then I gained it all back that weekend. And then I decided to do try out intermittent fasting. And I... From Monday till Friday, I lost four pounds, and then, actually, I guess I'm, I'm going to be repeating myself because I already did the, um, ending part of this video, so, okay, I gained back two, lost four, gained back two because my mom came, and I'll, I already explained that, so, um, okay, I started out my weight at 199 last week. Or the week before. Nope, last week. <clears throat> and, uh... Well, that's so weird. Oh, yeah, so I gained every pound back except for one. Okay. So I'm 198 point... I was 198.3. Um, I'm going to put a post a picture I just took just now. And I gained three ounces. So it's not going to look the same from what I'm saying. But that's why. Um, it's later in the day when I originally weighed myself. Alright, so from last week, my neck is still 14 inches, my arms are still 15 and a half inches, um, around my bust I actually lost a half a pound this week, uh, excuse me, a half an inch. Probably would have been more if I hadn't ate when my mom came. Okay, I ate when I was fasting. This seems to be the difference. Okay. Under, under my um, bust is 35 and a half, and I lost half an inch there. My waist is 36 and a half this week, um, and I lost an inch from last week. So, you guys, that's awesome. I'm um, around my belly button. I actually gained a half inch. Um, and then the hanging part of my belly, that where the pouch is at. Like, I lost a half inch. What? <laughs> you know my belly and around the belly button part, around the hanging part and the belly button part, they're generally the same, but not this time. Uh, my hips were at 39 this week, and last, well, so I lost an inch there. And around my butt, I stayed at 43 and a half. Um, honestly, I'm one of those girls that wants a booty, so I don't care about that. My right end left thighs both dropped a half an inch so I'm at 26 and a half 
and my calves stayed the same at 17 inches. So weight wise, if I look at everything I wrote down, I only lost one pound this week, technically. Um, but I lost a whole bunch of inches. Um, I lost one, two, three, I lost three and a half inches altogether this week. So you guys, that makes a difference. And I knew my clothes felt, even today when I got up and I was like, oh, they do, they do feel a little bit more tighter again. They were still looser than they were. So yeah, I'm still losing inches. So I'm happy about that, but you know, I'm going hard with the intermittent fasting. For 100 days, you guys, so I'm probably the rest of my life, but I'm I'm sticking to it for 100 days. That's three months in a week or something. So we're going to see. I'm going to do this update every week still, and uh, I will see you guys very soon. <laughs>
because they came both days. Uh, they brought breakfast the second day and there was donuts involved. Anyways, I just ate when I was, I was eating when I was supposed to be fasting. And um, the Monday through Friday, I wasn't perfect and I still lost four pounds. I ate Taco Bell one night, um, but I just adjusted my fasting hours and I still lost a pound the next by the next day, which was weird. Normally I would have gained two to three pounds. Um, and it is, for some reason, it's super easy for me to stick to it. Somehow knowing I got a, I got eight hours to eat, um, when I hit the end of the 16 hours of not eating, it's, for some reason, it's really helping me stick to it. Um, so even when I'm not eating perfect, I was still losing weight. Um, I still actually feel like I'm smaller but uh so friday i weighed 196 pounds um yesterday i weighed in at 198 so oh, yesterday was sunday so um yeah i gained two pounds but i am positive i'm going to relose that and uh this week and more um it's so it's so easy to stick to it. I, I really don't know why. Like I'm not depriving myself of the things I crave. Maybe that's what it is. I'm not depriving myself. I'll eat like a serving. Um, but I just I just stick to my calories and eat a serving of it. And um, so basically, I can do it every single day and and not have an issue. So far, <laughs> generally those used to be used to be issues, but. You know, I think I used to snack all day long, too. You know, like, eat a bite here, maybe eat one serving or two servings, not realize it. Just be like, oh, I just snacked on something, but really I ate, like, 200 calories. That that stuff adds up, you know. Um, so, you guys, intermittent, intermittent fasting is something I'm going to stick to. So, I'm not going to do a video every single day, but I am going to do the 100-day challenge um, for intermittent fasting. So I'm just going to stick to it for 100 days and I want to see what where this takes me. I'll probably stick to it. Probably f this might be a forever sort of thing, you guys. Like I I really love it. Um and I feel like I'm in control of my mind again. I don't know, it's so weird, but I just feel like I'm I'm in control. Like I don't feel like I'm floundering and drowning in my my desire to eat something and, and trying to fight it off. Um, it does get easier when I drink the Shakeology. The days I do drink that, my cravings aren't bad. Um, but I don't drink it every day like I should. So, I, um, it makes a difference. So, anyway, I am going to do this for 100 days. Um, and I will, of course, keep an update. I will update every week. Um, and let you know how it's gone for the week. Um, I don't want to do a video about intermittent fasting every single day. I, I don't think I'd have enough to talk about. So it is going to be a 100 day challenge. But uh, I would just do an update each week. Okay. Repeated myself enough, guys. Um, yeah, I apologize for, not, for no makeup today. Hopefully it doesn't look so bad. <laughs> I haven't got to it yet. Um, anyway. Okay. So, I'm on month two of a Max Insanity. Um, it was a little tougher today. I was definitely sweaty, as you saw already. And, uh... Alright, guys. <laughs> I'm done rambling, for real this time. Uh, so, I I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy watching my stuff. Um, yeah, please give me some um, advice in the bottom, in the comments, if you think I should do something. Um, please like, share, comment, um, subscribe, and uh, hashtag Team Love Yourselves, guys. Love you all, and I hope you have an awesome, awesome day. Bye!